Welcome back, everyone. Now time for the latest entertainment headlines. My girl Kennedy is here with what's popping off in the remix. Yes, Rochelle, we are kicking things off with Bow Wow's Dating World back in prime time, and that's what's topping off the remix. Welcome to a unique dating experience unlike any other. Well, let's talk about this new show, After Happily Ever After. That's such a dope name. Tell us about the show and like why you wanted to be a part of it. Yeah, I wanted to be a part of it because it was different. We've seen a million dating shows come and go, same format. They're very predictable. With this, it's not predictable. Black Girl Stuff's Brie Renee and Tori Bricks getting the lowdown on Bow Wow's new gig, BET's new Wednesday night reality series, After Happily Ever After. Are you afraid? No, we're here. You should be. The show's twisty premise puts the host right in the thick of some serious dating drama. Can your ex help you meet your next love? Imagine being in a house with your ex, and your ex has to find your next true love. Would you allow your ex to put you on a date? Ooh, any of them. Nah, nah. <laughs> nah? You wouldn't trust their ability to know what you need? Nah. Nah, hell nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> It might go down as Diddy's biggest surprise to date. Our chairman shocking students at Capital Prep in the Bronx. You, know, you hear that thing, I want to go back to my community and I want to do good. Um, but to be able to achieve that, it, it, it's really an accomplishment. You're the kings, you're the queens, you're the leaders. Diddy donated a million dollars to help the thriving charter school become a reality in 2020, in the same community where it all started for the three-time Grammy winner. To be able to go and open up a school in Connecticut, in Harlem, in the Bronx, this is like, you know, one of my proudest moments. Being from these neighborhoods, I could relate to what they're having to deal with right now. When you see somebody that looks like you and know came from your zip code, it, it's motivating and it's inspiring. There's no dream that they can't achieve. And dreams come true for this lit cheer squad showing off their slick routine to the hitmaker's new Queens remix of Gotta Move On. And we expect he'll also be back surprising students again and again. I think I'm gonna take it to the West Coast and take it to Atlanta after this, and take it to London, Paris, Africa, and we won't stop, because we can't stop. Y'all have a good day. Bye-bye, love. We need more difficult women in Hollywood. I'm gonna say that. Difficult to me means bold, it means audacious, it means ambitious. Elle magazine honoring Issa Rae, Zoe Kravitz, and Ariana DeBose, the ladies among those saluted at the 29th annual Elle Women in Hollywood celebration for their positive contributions to the arts. There's no job that a, that a woman can't do. Quite frankly, when, we, when we're in the rooms, we get them. Events like this are so important because it shows creation and content through our eyes, our lens, and our experience. Creatives Unite. The Revolt Xfinity Short and Fresh Film Festival hosted by B. Simone brought the talented minds behind film, TV, and beyond to Atlanta, sharing their expertise with the next generation of creators. Information, inspiration, and motivation. And all three of them are important. And sometimes that inspiration can lead to you changing your life. 